What up? It's your boy D. And I'm Jay. And this is D and J Movie Review. I hope everybody's having a good day today. How you been, man? Doing good, man. Hey, glad you're here, bro. Hey, it's been a long time, man, since we did, you know, a video together. But, man, we what? Come, we well, come. The last one we did was, what, Space Jam? Yeah, Space Jam. It was, about, it was like a couple weeks ago. I think a couple weeks ago before I went on my uh, vacation. Yeah, yeah, it was a couple weeks ago. You know, you went to your vacation. I went on my vacation. Yeah. Um, mm -hmm. But, yeah. But today, we're going to talk about... The movie that actually came out actually yesterday, mm -hmm. uh, Friday, Suicide Squad, the new one. Mm -hmm. Hey, I, I, uh, we got a lot to talk about this one. We're gonna talk. We, uh, pretty much, guys, we're gonna talk to y'all about the good, the bad, like what it'll be like about the, you know the scenes, and you right. know basically you know talk about you know, you know compare uh, compare and contrast from the first one to the second one and all okay. stuff. So. Pretty much, man. Uh, so, Darrell, bro. So, what's up? Want to get the good out of the way, bro? Yeah, I mean, you gonna start it. You know, I'm always in I'm always last. So, you go ahead and start it. So, I'm gonna be honest with you guys. Okay. Watching this movie, there was a lot of gore in this movie. And I love, I love the gore in this movie. The uh, action movie, tight. Um, I like Il in uh, Ildis Elba, his right. character. The leader. I, yeah, but, he, but he's called Bloodsport. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was his uh, name. Yeah. I thought he was honestly, bro. I thought he was Deadshot. I thought it was a. I thought he was a different Deadshot. But no. now they call now they call him Bloodsport. Blood I huh? never heard that character. But Ilda Silva, hey, he did stay in this movie, man. He, he, yeah, he, was, he, he was. He killed fighting. it. I give. I give him that. He killed it. Uh, so, uh, so pretty much with this movie, uh -huh. you got all the bad guys, you know, <clears throat> coming up together again. And they're trying to, you know, fight to save the world. And um, one thing that I like about this movie is, okay, uh, let's go and get to Harley Quinn, bro. Okay, Harley Quinn. There was one particular scene in the movie where she just pretty much served up everybody. Like this, like was it like military? Like um, what was it? Like military? You like, talking about? I'm just, I'm just going to give you a little thing. There's some spoilers in here, so... Oh, but, oh okay. If I'm you saying, haven't seen, seen this the movie, movie... Exit the DJ Movie Review. Yeah. Because this, but like... Here's some spoilers. In, the, uh, in some... the studio, we uh do a little spoiler stuff. So, if you don't... If you haven't seen the movie, so we're going to ask you to, you know, step aside yeah. from the DJ Movie Review. But the there studio. is some spoilers if you yeah, have not seen, seen it. But, so, hey... But yeah, like you talking about when they when she was in the castle with that dude. Yeah, honestly, did she? Okay, she got kidnapped. No, she didn't. No, well, yeah, they she captured, did get kidnapped. Yeah, they captured. They captured her, right? And then um, <laughs> the crazy thing about it is, um, mm -hmm. like, she was in what was that guy's name that was in? Uh, she was in that room with. And he talking. This is crazy. I just think it was a bad for me, but he was just like saying that I just want to marry you. Yeah, I mean, who would want to marry Harley Quinn? She, I mean, she's, she's psycho. She's crazy. psycho and crazy, but, <laughs> you know, who wouldn't want to marry, you know, Harley Quinn? I mean, and the person who actually plays Harley Quinn. Oh, yeah, Mark, Ooh, uh, Mark Lord. Lord, she, she's mm, fine, man. Mm, but mm. the crazy thing about this man, What's I fine? love, you know, I love the, the camera work in this movie, the visuals. Right. And when I say that, there was a lot. Honestly, this movie pretty much is almost like James Gunn made this movie like a slasher film, bro. James Gunn did a really good. Yeah, movie. he made a slasher film. And, you know, and you can see a lot of horror elements in the movie. There was some horror elements in the movie, but it was still tight. Now, now I like uh, my favorite part, you know, character in the movie. I like uh, Shark King. He was tight. Shark King. Nice. Especially when his, he was like this, like they was having that meat. He said, and. <laughs> nah, my favorite. He said, and. Uh -huh. That yes, was the that your hand. <laughs> yeah, that, that was good. But my favorite part was when uh, when he picked up uh, the, the, the girl who controlled the rats. Yes. He was almost about, to, almost about to eat her. I was like, dang. And then if Bloodsport yeah, yeah, Bloods Bloods didn't even get over there trying to shoot the saber, like. Yeah. You do not eat your teammates. 
He didn't even he, know that. He didn't know but that. He, he just, hey, he was just hungry, bro. He just wanted the meal. It's so. a shark. It's mm -hmm. a shark. You know, a shark got to eat. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so you're right. The shark, the shark, the shark actually does got to eat. Yeah. Man. You know, they, they smell blood and it's over. Yeah, man. Uh, so what else? I mean, what else did you like about, you know, the movie? Um, just the, you know, the way that James Gunn, you know, pretty okay. much, you know, the way he put, like, so much he put in this film, man, it just, it was just so tight. Uh -huh. You know, um, like I, like I said, it's, I'm going to be honest, it's a fun movie. It is a funny movie. It is a funny movie. Because I, because... You see in the movie, there's a, like a dialogue between John Cena and their just other their characters and all stuff. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie. There was there was one part in the movie where um, talking about eating dicks. <laughs> who whoever put that in that eating <laughs> dicks? Really? Come on, man. Come on. Man. Like, oh man, that's crazy. He, he bro. said, "If there's a million dicks on the beach, I will I'll eat million all these million dicks." <laughs> I'm like, really? Whoa, whoa. I'm like, bro, I'm like, James, I'm like, James, bro, what was you trying to prove right there, bro? Like, seriously. John I Cena, like, I mean, I, I think he did good in this movie. Uh, I'm, not, I'm not gonna lie. Starting to watch him, I was getting a little annoying the way he talked. But, <laughs> yeah. but he did pick it up. And um, just like I said, between him him and uh, Ildis Elba, like, they was just, you know, going back and forth. They and so, and, and so each other. I like that dialogue between the two. Yeah. And, um. But uh, well, one thing is is that I wish that um, we could have got a little bit, you know. I mean, because we got like, like I said, we got the fight scenes with you know uh, Harley Harley Quinn, right. and I would like to see how she got all that combat enhancement. I mean, I know it's Harley Quinn; she's good. Right, but it's just that the way that she served up the military type, like the military dudes, I was just like, wow, because I'm not, because like in the uh, in the first Suicide Squad movie, you know, I mean, she used the gun, she used the baseball bat, and you know, she used like air uh, you know, she used like a lot of you know stuff like gymnastics and stuff, stuff like in that. there, yeah. But in this one, she went ham, bro. She had that, uh, what was it that that uh, stick from that? Uh, she had a. Uh, this thing, it's like a, it's like a stick, and she was just twirling around. I know she's, yeah, about. and she was serving everybody up, and I was like, dang it! I mean, like it was just like, I'm like, dang it! So Harley Quinn was just pretty much OP right there, bro. I'm like, dang. I mean, you just gotta think about it. Harley Quinn knows everything, cause I mean, her love is the Joker, so the Joker probably showed her how to use guns and showed her how to use weapons. But Harley Quinn's always been a G, from the TV series to the cartoon series to you know the movies. Harley Quinn has always been the G. Yeah. But, you know, I, I think they could have, I mean, I liked Harley Quinn in this one, and she she did really good. Um, but my favorite part is just how, uh, what's his name? The uh, Bloodshot? Yeah, Bloodsport. 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 He, Bloodsport. He, did, he did a really good job, and I, I think he... Like I said, Erdos Elba, he carried, he carried part of the movie. You know yeah, because he, he's a leader. Yeah, he's supposed and, to be a leader. <laughs> one, one thing is... Uh, who who was, was that a rat? Was it uh, no, it's a weasel? Weasel. How in the hell? Whoa, this is this is one thing I don't get. And then my mom pointed this out. <laughs> he was like, he said the weasel don't swim. I mean, I, I was like, bro, weasels don't what, swim. What did what, what, was what the, purpose you trying to prove, bro? Like there was some parts in there. I, it, it got me actually confused. It's like okay, one again, spoiler alert, just to let you know. That you know, the weasel jumps out the airplane into the water, drowns. Trying to, <laughs> try, trying to doggy paddle, but you know, that ain't <laughs> happening. But then the Can't dude, with the dude who actually you know let his arms go and try to slap people, what the hell was that, bro? I ain't gonna lie, that like that was honestly that was a oh that was a bad for me. I was looking like. Is he doing? Like, bro, exactly. Like, bro, and like, like, I was. He's smacking around. I'm like, bro, you got military guys that are pointing like AK 47s. A lot of yeah, yes, bro. They all got guns pointed at y'all, and them bullets is flying everywhere. And you taking your arms to go smack somebody. 
trash. Don't like that. Yeah, I didn't like that. Either. <laughs> and like the, the things that I, I mean, that actually I was like, okay, you got a weasel. You got him, you know, his arms coming out. Then you got the girl who looked like a a, a lizard jumping on helicopters and trying to bring it down. Oh, she you know, died. You know what? You know it, what, bro? But one one thing I didn't like, they let my boy Boomerang die. That Spoiler alert. That that hurt me. That hurt me. I'm gonna be honest with you. Because he was in the he was he was bro, actually in the first one. one. Yes. Honestly, that hurt me. I was just like, what? They killed Boomerang? Oh, and he's like one of like Flash's, you know, uh, Flash's like best like villains, bro, that he went up against. Yeah. Yeah, but I'm like, bro, Boomerang, listen, Boomerang is legit. Let's get that straight forward. Yeah, he, Boomerang yeah. is not average. He's not trash, bro. No. Boomerang is the real deal. The way he threw that, I ain't gonna lie. Now I did like when he threw that, that Boomerang thing. And then oh, yeah, I was that, like, yeah, tight. that's I'm one like, thing. Hey, that's, that's, that is one thing I did like about the movie. It did have it was really gory. Yeah. And you know I love how way like I said, shout out to James Gunn, man. Like in this honestly, man, I'm hoping that he will get another DC project and hopefully we can get the same as like, yeah. that same aspects again. Yeah. Like we did with this movie. And, you know, yeah, man, like this, like I said, this movie was real gory. And I was like, yo, I said, DC's going all the way out. Yeah, I, I did. I did like that. But um, another funny part is when they went to the village and they killed, Bro, spoiler alert, they well, killed I mean, everybody. I mean, I mean, I'm going to say this. this. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> just like again, like I said. Ilda Silver and John Cena, bro. Now, I ain't gonna lie. John Cena went. He, he walked up, like, because his pace, like, he called uh, Peacemaker. That's, that's Peacemaker. Name, Peacemaker. When he walked up, that dude was, like, laying on the bed. He did this. Yes. I yes. was like, that damn. Was good. That was bro, good. Like, like, damn, bro. Like, this certain moment, it's like, nah, and, and you know part, he's strong, bro. Yeah, and another part was when he went on top of the uh, the, the house. And he started spitting the, those things. Yes, yeah, the, the darts and all the darts. Stuff. Yeah, that, that was like, really like bro, like, yeah, he was a certain <laughs> and when they run, when they went to go find the, the other dude, and he was like, and that woman's like, you just killed my whole family. And it was like, uh, nah, nah, we we, uh, we didn't know. <laughs> so, I mean, I, I, they had some really good dialogue. One thing I did not like about the movie mm -hmm. is that they they could have left some of some of those characters out like i mean is it better than the 2016 movie yes yes, yes. i like it action wise action plus, wise plus, plus, yes. plus like i said james james gunn he pretty much delivered um a horror kind of horror slasher yeah. aspect to the movie and that's what basically got everybody you know stoked about this film cuz right. I mean, pretty much i mean i'm going to be honest with you man and this is like another thing too like, well, when you're directing a movie, you got to know how to use these characters. If these characters are dark, man, you got to go all out. I mean, you got, I mean, like, seriously, you got to go out. You can't just light up, you know, here and there, like, oh, I can't do this and all this stuff. Nah, man, go ahead. Like, amp that thing up, bro. Like, for real. Don't, yeah, be, afraid, yeah, don't be afraid yeah. to amp that thing yeah, up. Yeah, I mean, I understand you got to amp, you know, you got to amp these, you know, these characters, these dark characters up. Yeah. yeah. And... And it's just, you know, another good part I like it is when ah, the rat girl, I don't know her name. I swear. I'm sorry. If y'all know her name, put a comment down there so, you know, we actually know her name. Um, but I like how she was telling the story about the rat and her and her and her father. Yeah. You know, her father was a drug addict and, yeah. you know, she he was shooting up, but he still loved his daughter. Yeah. And that's crazy, though. That, 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 bro, that's what I said. This movie basically had, you know, messaged about had drugs bro I'm like yo like and, and you know that's just something that i did like about it is that you know that's the reason why she always sleeps and that's why the rat was always around her mm -hmm. it's because the rats made her safe yeah and because yeah. her father remember when they was actually cold and she said when the rats actually kept her warm her and her father warm when they're on the streets when they was actually cold i did like that and, you know that's a father that's a father figure who makes sure that her his daughter is always safe Mm -hmm. and, and you know, a father will always find a way to actually make sure his family or his daughter or his son is always good and always safe. So I like that. And when Il and when um, blood 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 blood, blood, sport, sport blood sport. was actually uh, telling him about the reason why he doesn't like rats. 
Yeah. And you know, it's you know. I mean, who? I mean, bro, who? Who likes bro? I mean, I'm gonna be honest with I mean, you. I mean, rats doesn't bother me. It's just that you know, they I don't, don't wanna. I mean, nah. here's the thing. Rats don't bother me. I mean, rats, they got to do what they got to do. But, bro, let me see a rat roaming around here right in front of me, bro. I'm sorry. I'm getting out of here. Right? I mean, so rat part. is like Stuart Little. <laughs> it's like Stuart Little. Rats are not going to hurt you. Uh, I mean, some people got phobias about rats and some people don't like rats. But uh, I'm just saying, it's just a rat. I mean, rats are nasty. Uh, bro, but, no, 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 hey, no, no. I was I raised in the hood. Uh, so. I don't know what talking about, bro. I don't like rats. Hey, I was raised in the hood, rats. so I, I, I know how it is. And You see a rat in your house, bro. How y'all going to act? <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna chill. A rat, rat doesn't. A rat doesn't bother me. I'm like, oh, there's a rat. You better get some rat traps, some peanut butter, and some uh, and some sticky pads. I'm gonna get something. Shoot, <laughs> I'm gonna kill that rat. Now. But uh, so, okay, got a question. What grade would you give this movie? Grade I would give this movie. Yeah, I'm gonna be honest. With the the way that uh, James Gunn incorporated the, like the movie, the camera, the okay. visuals. Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and give this movie. Um, I'm gonna go put it out there. I'm gonna give it a B plus. Okay. I'm gonna give it a B plus because okay. this, I mean, like I said, this movie. Now I'm gonna go ahead and, and you know back up a little bit. I want to get too ahead of myself. Okay. Do I think that this movie because I like, was like yeah could been better? Yes, of course. Do I think that this movie is like one of the like best DC movies that I've seen? No, no, uh, no, absolutely not. Like I said, but DC, y'all do have a chance to you know redeem yourself. I will say that because I mean, yeah. I mean, going forward, I mean, like I said, I mean, the door is wide open. I mean, y'all got a lot of like I said. You know what we got this year, Darrell? We had Justice League, the Snyder Cut, bro, mm -hmm. and then. What else did we get? There was another. Was there another DC movie that we got? I don't think so. I no, I, 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 I did. That was, yep, that was okay. it. And this, and this Suicide Squad. So pretty much, man. DC, y'all have the tools, man. So hey, y'all just keep like going forth, man, and just you know getting these characters out there, man, and just mm -hmm. you know, like I said, you know, make it happen, man. I honestly, when I, I watch, remember when I called you uh, that night when I when I was watching it, and I told you I was like, I give it a C minus uh -huh. to a to a B. Yeah, I rewatched it, and I watched the the first Suicide Squad, and I, I was like, okay, I I give it a B minus. Okay, I give it a, a B because, minus because okay, because I mean because I'm gonna tell like this because you think that so. Let me ask you this, Darrell. Do you think that uh, the first one had a good narrative than this one? Yes, it did. Okay, yes, that's what that's the way I. Feel I think I think it had a it had a better nar a narrative to this one, but than, than, uh, than, 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 than two thousand sixteen than this one. Um, yeah, but I mean, you. I mean, I think honestly, blood. Uh, blood damn sport. it, damn blood, blood sport. sport, and you know, dead shot. You know, Will Smith and Idris Elba. Idris Elba I think they was on the same platform and on the same level. They both acted really well. And, you know, you, you still have the Harley Quinn in 2016 and the Harley Quinn in 2021. That's what I'm saying. They both I, did, I I mean, enjoy, they, they I both enjoy, did the same thing. With this movie, I enjoy, um, I enjoyed Ilda Selby's uh, character. Yeah, right. Margot Robbie, you right. know, shout out to her. Margot Robbie, keep doing what you're doing, baby girl, because like I said, you killed it. You killed it as Harley Quinn. Quinn. Um, and you know, um, I, 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 and, and you know, Shark King, Shark. I'm gonna tell you something. You he know was Shark King. Shark King was tight. I mean, <laughs> just like, like towards the end, like going towards the end of when that thing was falling off and he fell down there, and then next you know they were shooting bullets at him. Had no effect. That's another thing too. That pissed me off. I mean, like they were shooting, and no bullets had no effect. He got up and just basically. <laughs> Got a hold one of them soldiers, and I, uh, you know, nah, but he, him felt, up, hey, he felt it when them damn jellyfish or whatever was biting on his ass. Oh yeah, I ain't gonna lie, he did feel that. Yeah, he did feel that. But them bullets had no effect, though, bro. They yeah, had no nah, effect. Nah, nah. And then, <laughs> then, like I said, he get away. Hey, okay, down, okay, okay, he okay. Got I got one for you. <laughs> what about the big ass starfish? <laughs> okay, now that right there, it 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 took me. It honestly, it was like, I was like, what the fuck? What, what are we going to do about this big ass starfish? And it's just like how on Fast on uh, on Fast 9 when they went to fucking outer space in a car. 
You got I, come on now. I don't honestly. I, I, I don't. What know. we but, gonna but, do but, about but, this starfish? I don't know. Bro. I mean, <laughs> where they? I mean, where they get? And you know, oh my homeboy, the polka dot dude. Hey, he thought everybody was his mama. I'm just here and say like, okay, you got the polka dot dude who who's throwing these polka dots, firing them, killing them. Then you got this big ass starfish. Like, what are you going to do with this starfish? It, I don't know. Dude. It, it, come on, now. It, it was it, that's that's what threw me off. That's the reason why guys are B minus. Is that what we going to do about this big ass starfish? And why is the starfish out of space? <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, and you is. catch a, the government catches the starfish and then he lets out these little starfish like little babies and put them against their face and now he control, control and now he controls them like zombies yeah pretty much it sounds sure. like it sounds like look if that happens look like we got COVID again so uh, <laughs> but yeah y'all be safe out there with that COVID real talk there's yeah. a lot of people going so, you know getting sick anyway man so I was going to tell you uh, so Darrell, what's up? Uh, what are your final thoughts on the movie? Bro? My final thoughts, I really like this movie. The movie was funny. It has some, it has some dead parts in it, but I thought it was really funny, and I definitely give it a B. And um, it, it, it was good. It, it was good. I mean, it is it better in 2016? Yes, I thought so. Yeah, I really thought so. Um, but I, I really liked. It. I really, I really enjoyed it because it was gory, and it was it, it made the, sense, but it didn't was, make sense. Yeah, but like I, but I ain't gonna lie. Be honest, the the first team that was you know the start of the movie, I'm glad. Stop. Yeah, I'm glad. I'm glad that they got out of the picture. Thank you, James Gunn, because they was absolutely annoying me starting the movie. And the next, you know, then you see uh, Michael Rooker's character when he seen everybody was getting wrecked. He was like, "No," and trying to swim in the water. And after that, she said, "Dang it!" Then press that button, and boom. Brain spread everywhere, and I was like, Man. Yeah, that's just it. I, again, I tough I, times, yeah, you're right. It's a tough time, and I, I, I give it a B. And it, it was it was funny. I, I laughed during the movie. Uh, some people's not gonna like it, some people's not gonna like this movie, some people will. So, I mean, I, just, I mean, like I said, if you're a horror, if you're a horror slasher uh fan, you'll probably enjoy this movie. You know, I mean, you like I said, it does have a little bit of horror aspect, yeah, and that does have a lot of gory. They went all in in this movie. So shout out to James Gunn, man. Like, for real. And I'm, and I'm and side note, before we, you know, we end this video. Uh, no, hold on. Um, what did you give it? Like, what do you think about this movie? Um, Like I said, I, the movie was, like I said, I enjoyed the movie because it had, like, that's like you said, it had a lot of gory in there and, you know, a lot of, um, uh, uh, the, like, the visuals is what got me uh -huh. stoked. And so that's the reason why, you know, I gave it, you know, a B. What's that? I said a B plus. B plus. A B plus. So pretty much, like I said, going forward, DC, y'all have a chance to, like, pretty much, you know, have, you know. They have the tools. You have, have the, the tools. You have the tools to pretty much, you know, get, you know, a lot of stuff out there. And, you know, and like I said, man, I can't wait to see what DC has in store, man. Because honestly, that, I mean, like I said, it was not. It was not the best best movie that I've seen, but is it like better enough? Absolutely, it was better. It was better. So it was, I mean, it like was, I said, yeah. I mean, I, so I said I enjoyed the movie. I respect so. that. I, I totally do respect that. But uh, hey, I, honestly, if y'all haven't go seen it, haven't seen this movie, go see it, and I think y'all probably enjoy it. There's gonna you're gonna be like, uh, what 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 happened? But there's gonna be some spots in there you're gonna laugh, and there don't have your kids watch this. I mean, it's yeah, rated hard anyway. It's rated hard, so I mean, parents, <laughs> let's 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 be smart about this. Uh, but hey, I, I hope y'all like it, and I hope y'all you know y'all tell us how what y'all feel about the movie. And and I look, my name is D, and I'm Jay, and don't forget to hit that like, share, and subscribe button, man. Yep, I always do that. Share try, this with uh, share this with all your friends and everything, man. So, hey, we try to make we try to make everything grow. We try to you know we try to be up there and you know try to have a good time and you know have YouTube like yo they doing their thing. But uh, my name is D and y'all have a good day and enjoy it. God bless. Peace. Peace.